Hey everyone, what is going on? So, um, yeah, I wanted to make a video discussing the Pokemon that we are never going to have. You're not going to have them. I'm not going to have them. Um, you know, everybody watching this video will never have them, unfortunately. Uh, I'm, unfortunately, that's the case. Now, I'm not talking about, uh, like the Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Pokemon, like Stack Attack or Poipol, or, you know, any of those, or even the Dusk Form Lycanroc, uh, because those are not even programmed into the game. So I'm not going to be including, uh, those. I'm only including the ones that are actually, uh, programmed into the game's data. Uh, th so, unfortunately, um, yeah, we're never gonna get these Pokemon, unless if they, I guess, in theory, they could go and update the game after the automated events end, if they wanted to. I don't see that happening. We know the events up and through the July, and these are not included in them. I'm assuming that after July, they're just gonna repeat all the events, again, beginning with week one. Uh, but we'll have to see. Um, yeah, so, I really doubt they're gonna update it, but, you know, who, who knows, who knows. But either way, as of right now, we are never gonna have these. Now, I know some other Pokemon, like Marshadow, are not gonna be included on this list, because we are gonna get them. They are coming. So, uh, the Pokemon on this, on this list are not coming, basically. So, yeah, why don't we begin? So when, uh, yeah, we're never gonna have three Pikachus, and I actually understand why, uh, we're not getting these, because they're kind of depressing, right? You have, like, a sad face Pikachu, you have, a, I, I don't know if that's grumpy or sad or depressed, or, and then you have one that's about to cry, so, you know, I, 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 I it could be, be a, a depressing mood, so I totally understand why they didn't, uh, release those. I actually think they look cool, uh, but uh, I do get why they they never released them. But it, you know, it is unfortunate that we're never going to be able to get these because, uh, as I said, they do look cool. And I know some people might have been getting tired with uh, all of the Pikachu forms. I get it, but personally, I like Pikachu and I like uh, the different facial expressions. I don't really care for just the winking ones necessarily, but I like the different kind of expressions like the angry Pikachu and, and you know, the ones with the hats and things like that. So I would have personally been okay with getting these, but uh, yeah, we're not going to have them. Uh, we're not going to get them. We'll never see them in our games. And you know, unless if you hack a hackier game or whatnot, then you'll get them. But I guess, I don't know. But either way, we're not going to uh, get these. Who knows if they would have been good? Probably not because most Pikachus are basically there for the collectability, they're not there for uh, their overpowered um, abilities. But some 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 Pikachus are good, but outside of, uh, you know, a few of them, most of them are not. But either way, I would have liked to have them. But anyway, uh, let's move on. We have a, a, quite a few winking ones. We have winking Clefable, winking Marrow, and then we have winking Shroomish, winking uh, plus a winking minum, winking Pekari and winking Pekarisu. So, um, yeah, these Pokemon, we're never gonna get these either. Uh, again, more winkers. Um, I really like, uh, Shroomish, so it's a, a little bit disappointing that we're not getting that, I guess. Um, excuse me, there's two more. Winking Aromatist and winking Dedenny. So, yeah, we're not getting any of these winkers, you know. Uh, quite a few of them, actually, unfortunately. Uh, not gonna have them, never gonna get them, never gonna add them to your collection. Uh, if I had to guess, I would say that Aromatist could be good, but, you know, it, it, it all depends what ability, they could give any, any Pokemon an ability, you know, because they give them raise max levels and they could give, uh, you know, the Shroomish like 20 raise max levels if they wanted to with in, insane ability. So, you never know, any one of them could have been good, uh, but as I said, Aromatist, Probably would have been my guess because it's like the final evolution or whatnot, or I guess even Clefable. But anyway, we're not going to get these in our game, which is a little bit unfortunate. Uh, I would have liked to have them, even though I'm, I'm not a huge fan of the winking Pokemon. But um, it's still nice. Um, you know, I still want them uh, knowing that they exist in the, in the game's code, you know. Uh, do you guys feel that same way? Uh, I don't know, but you know, that's just my opinion. That is just my opinion. So, uh, let's move on. We have, look at this guys. We have basically all of the unknown. We've gotten six unknown. So we have, let's see what we have. We have A, B, D, F, G, H, J, K, L, M, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Huh, that's a, that's a mouthful. <laughs> I mean, yeah. I don't know why they haven't released these Pokemon, um, you know, maybe they felt like it was, uh, too much, or whatnot, who knows, 
I don't know if they couldn't put them all in the same safari, right? I mean, they could have split them up, I guess. Uh, they could have given them out over time. For whatever reason, they did, they just decided not to do that. I thought when they released, uh, the fourth that they did in a safari, I thought that's when they were going to, um, add, add them. Uh, start to add all of them, but not the case. I always felt like Unknown should have been like in its um, kind of like a, its own unique challenge where you could um, earn them or win them or something somehow. Uh, not necessarily like just beat them, but you complete certain challenges per day or something. And that can unlock a different unknown uh, or something, just because they're kind of like ancient Pokemon in a way, um, you, you know. So they're kind of unique. So that would have been cool, but not the case. Uh, GS is never going to give these unknown to us, unfortunately. Um, I mean, it's it really is unfortunate because I would have liked to have the collection. It seems strange having only like six of them uh, available, but you know, it is what it is. Uh, we're not going to get them. So uh, let's move on. We have Cherim Overcast form and Domanitan Zen mode. Um, Cherim, I mean, I'm not a huge fan uh, of any of these, uh, to be honest with you. I don't even know how they transform into these forms. I think with Cherim, it, it either has to be sunny or maybe rainy. I, I don't, I don't know. I, I don't know what Cherim's up to. Uh, Domanitan, I have no idea how it transforms into Zen mode. You know, I knew it back in black and white. I remember playing through black and white the first time I used the Domanitan. I don't remember how it transformed into Zen mode. I think it had, I don't know if it had to use a move or maybe it depended on it's HP, I don't know, but either way, uh, we're not gonna get these Pokemon, unfortunately. Uh, I believe that the Manitan Zen mode was actually removed from the game's code, so it's not, it doesn't even exist anymore. I don't know why, like, it, it was available from the beginning in the code, not in the game, uh, but for whatever reason, one at one point in time when they updated the game they removed it i'm not really sure why it it was removed so we wouldn't get this one anyway um but yeah so i did want to mention it because obviously the sprite of it does exist just because it did at one point exist in the in the game's code but we're not going to get it we're not going to get Cherim overcast uh, let me know if there's more pokemon that were removed completely from the game's code um, other than the mana 10 zen mode they might have uh, that might have been. I'm not really sure why they felt to, to remove it. If they didn't want to release it, fine, but why remove it? I don't know. But either way, uh, we're not getting these two, so, um, we're gonna move on from now, uh, for now, and we're gonna discuss my personal two favorite, the Zygarde forms, Zygarde Cell and Zygarde Core. I just, I, I like these Pokemon. I don't, I don't know what, if you can call them Pokemon. I guess they're technically not even Pokemon. I don't know. They, they would have had, uh, a Pokedex number, the same as Zygarde, if, if they were released, so, uh, who knows, I'm sure they wouldn't necessarily be good, because they probably have very low attack power, maybe no attack power at all, because in the games they don't have attack power, and they're not even Pokemon, as I just said, you know, they, they just combine together to form, like, Zygarde, so, you know, a little bit, uh, disappointing that they decided never to release these. I would have personally loved them. I remember when the automated events were announced. I would, there was a few Pokemon I was looking for specifically, and that was Marshadow and these two. So, uh, I'm a little bit unfortunate that we're never going to get them. Uh, I would have liked them. I mean, they could make them good. They could give them like 20 Raise Max levels. They could even go even crazy and give them 50 Raise Max levels and make their attack power super high. Uh, they could have done it, but they're not going to do it. So, we're not going to own these, uh, which is you know, really unfortunate. Um, yeah, as I said, though, any of these could have been good. They could make anything they want good by just giving them a bunch of raise max levels and, you know, other awesome skills. Uh, but yeah, let me know which is your favorite uh, of all of these. Uh, obviously, we don't know which ones would be good, so I'm not saying which ones uh, are better than others because none of, none of them are better than anything else because abilities for them don't exist. You know, I don't know if they had plans uh, of abilities. Maybe they had specific abilities in mind. Uh, who knows? Another thing is, like, all my videos are unscripted, so if I did make a mistake, uh, please let me know. Point me out on it, you know, uh, in the comments below. Uh, I, I like doing unscripted uh, 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 discussions and things like that, so, you know, definitely let me know if I made a mistake on any of these. Uh, and, but, yeah, let me know, uh, as I said, which one is your favorite and which one are you disappointed in not going to be able to own. Uh, it would be cool if GS, after the automated uh, updates, at least, like, like, did one more final check-in and just gave us all of these Pokemon, even if they had bad abilities, uh, just release them all, because why not? I mean, they're not going to uh, do anything with them unless if they 
as I said, do update the game after July, but I, I think that's unlikely. But, um, you know, if they do, obviously, I'd be really, you know, happy about it, but I don't think they will. But anyway, as I said, let me know which one is your favorite. And, yeah, so, uh, hold up. Is that Winking Clefable a Winking, um, Winking... Uh, wiggly tough. That's Clefable, right? I did mention, I did say Clefable. I don't know if I said Wiggly tough or Clefable. I'll probably, sorry about that, guys. Anyway, that's totally not what we're discussing. Uh, thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you guys in the next one, and I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.